To Mr. Rick Perry, I saw the news today about President Barack Obama's policy to ensure the rights and protections of LGBT people abroad. And then I saw Hillary Clinton's amazing speech given at the United Nations on international LGBT civil rights and what I am sure is going to go down in history for our movement. Today was absolutely a glorious day. And then I saw your response and I had to give a response back. My name is Sean Chapin, and I am a gay American born and raised in San Francisco 35 years ago. I discovered that I was gay when I was a teenager and fell in love with a guy in high school. I fought that attraction as hard as I could for well over a year, even lying down in bed after I got home from school to will and pray that attraction away. And of course, nothing changed. So I finally accepted myself and came out of the closet. That was 18 years ago. And I've been attracted to guys for each and every one of those 18 years. And that's probably not going to change for as long as I continue to live. So if there is ever a choice in any of this, it's that I choose to be who I am and not live a lie. Out of love and respect for myself, for a partner who deserves my love back, and for children who deserve parents who love each other. And I understand that because I am gay, I probably won't be able to have a kid the same way a man and a woman naturally can. Yet, so many people fail to realize that because I am gay, I can be great for society. As I can be a check against overpopulation, as I can welcome an orphan kid into my home as a parent, as I can strengthen immediate families as a good relative, and as I can still create life artificially. So really, I can make life better for everyone around me just because of who I am, just like everybody else. However, you go out of your way to attack me because I am gay reducing me down to a lifestyle, vilifying me as special. You even believe that I have declared war against other Americans who are different from me. Yet what angers and offends me the most is that you suggest that I am against American values. Ask me what America's values are and I will tell you that the ultimate American value is the belief that each of us chooses our own values that we want to guide our unique lives. To me, that's why our country is founded on liberty and equality, and that's why I cherish my American citizenship so dearly. And that's why I'm exercising that citizenship by making this video. Mr. Rick Perry, whether or not I am gay or straight, I do choose to love or to hate, and so do you, and so does every other American. And it seems to me that you've made your choice loud and clear, so I'm here to stand up to it. You not only don't care to want to get to know us better as gay people, you have outright declared war against us, hiding behind the disguise of protecting traditional values, going so far as to want to officially investigate us as a president for our imaginary war against other Americans with traditional values. You call that a presidency? I call that a threat to the security of gay Americans and to every other American. And you can bet that we're waking up to this right now and we're coming out to defend our country against your campaign and against other campaigns just like yours. Defend